for 550 million and later bought it back for just a dollar. I mean, he got, he got, he sold it and got 550 million and then, and then bought he bought it back, it back for a dollar. That's it, a good swindle. If you didn't know, I mean, we got a video right here. Play the video and then we'll come back and talk. Here's how I think it went down. Penn wanted to do a deal with Disney. They didn't, Disney didn't want you in the deal. Didn't want your name there at all. So you took back Barstool and then that freed up Penn to be bought by Disney for $2 billion. Have I got that right? Well, they didn't buy him. They're doing the deal. I don't know exactly. I wasn't involved in the conversations. But you bought back your company oh, for $1. Oh, I bought back one my dollar. company. Yeah, I bought my, my company back for $1. But we had a great relationship with Penn. How much did you sell it for in the first place? I think the total was around... So we did two things. I think it was $500 million, somewhere around there. So you bought it back for <laughs> yeah, a buck. Correct. <laughs> it's a good deal. Gave I'm, I'm happy with, with the deal. I, I feel good. I'm wearing a nice polo in here. Uh... It's a good day, and it's a good day for Barcelona. I think it's a good day for Penn as well. But yeah, it was definitely a good deal. Uh, your net worth is now what? Can you tell me? Well, there's so much, you know, zeros and stuff, Stuart. Oh. I, no, I, I, I honestly, there's a lot of. Wait, there's a lot 400 of million, 500 million. I don't know. I, I, I would have to. You well, if I sell Barcelona again, Penn gets half of it. That was part of the deal. So True. I don't know. I don't know. How does one figure out net worth? There's a lot of big numbers. I was never a math guy. <laughs> well, you've got a big number behind your name. What are you going to do with it? Well, I bought a horse for 650 grand the night that this happened. So that's a start. <laughs> I'll spend. I spend freely. But, you know, Barstool. We just got all the expenses. We got leases. I so, so Penn bought ES or Disney Channel for no, two no, billion dollars. No, uh, Disney bought Penn Penn Gaming, and but they didn't want uh, Barstool or Dave Portnoy to be a part of it because I think even though that Dave sold the company Barstool, mm -hmm. he was still like a part of it in some ways. So they basically Penn sold him back the company for a dollar. So that wouldn't be included in the purchase. So Disney is just purely buying that Penn Gaming. But I'm not familiar with uh, Penn or Penn Gaming. If that's like a group or like a, a gaming house that makes certain games. I hadn't really heard of that. I do like gaming and check it out sometimes. But I'm not a super, uh, you know, I guess you could say nerd or just super informed whenever it comes uh, to the gaming realm. So put it down in the comments if you know uh, more about Penn Gaming. True, and I mean, I guess that's what it is. I mean, when you're an independent company and you want to talk all crazy, it's the price you got to pay. People don't want to do business with you. The the fact that they they were willing to, they were willing to only what they got they got two million. What well, they got what Disney bought Penn for two billion for two billion. So so really, they really bought them for a hundred one point five billion billion because they gave back. They basically lost half a mil. They, I mean, they still paid $2 billion. They paid $2 they billion. Didn't, they didn't lower the price. It's just that they didn't want that associated with their brand. So they're like, disconnect us from like so the package the you're selling us. And so they still got the $2 billion. But, I mean, you, but I'm saying like you you pay, you paid the $55 million. So now you negative $55 million. Oh, yeah. But then you win $2 billion. Oh, yeah. So basically you, you got $1.5 billion. Yeah. I guess. And they're saying, like, it's not stopping here. Like, they're trying to go more and more. Supposedly, ESPN is finally in, including in sports betting, which is crazy because y'all got on Barry Bonds about that. Y'all got on so many people about sports betting. Well, and so many uh, sports YouTube channels are sponsored by. Exactly. Or brought to you by sports betting places. I know, like, Gills Arenas, by, what, like, by Underdog and all kinds of other places. So. You know, there's a bunch of it, so it's, it's kind of weird how that's kind of infiltrated the sports world. True, and I'm seeing more and more football players get. I'm seeing more and more athletes get caught for sports betting and getting uh getting suspended for the season, again kicked out the league, which doesn't make any sense. Like if you bet on, and they're not even betting on a lot. They're not betting like, oh yeah, I'm I'm winning like like Drake money, two hundred and fifty k. Like they paying like one hundred twenty dollars, a thousand dollars here, a thousand dollars there, if that. And they bet in other games, and they and they get found, they get caught. It's just too it's much. It's really not worth it for them to be betting like that, but people like to bet, and if you're not supposed to, it can become a problem. This is gonna feel just like the whole college football thing, like when all of the college football players back in the day they couldn't couldn't make any money off their name and off their rights, but now now with the whole I think IPA or whatever it's called, they can make money. Like I just heard uh, that Reese girl, 
the uh, the, the Angela girl, Reese, Angela from Reese. She has like or five Angela or six Reese. nit deals. She has five or six like like five oh, or yeah. ten deals. So she's gonna be making bank to the point where she don't even want to go to the WNBA. I heard that that some of the big college girls will actually be like. I'm going to play all four years of college because all the sponsorship deals that I'm getting in college are actually more mm -hmm. than I would get was the WNBA contract. So a lot of, for girls now, it's even made it where they want to play the full, the full four years. See, but I mean, you don't,